Towards the end of the experiment, you had to make a mercy dash back to Perth to care for your sick dog. Yeah. We're going to take a look back at that now because there's something there we need some clarification on. OK. Little Oscar. Yeah. Is there some tea? Where is it? So it was a long flight home, but finally home with my little Oski. <laughs> Oski doesn't want to get off the floor this morning, so I'm on the floor with him. <laughs> He's got a scan today um, on his heart. So just an update with Oscar. He's had his scans today. He's had his ultrasound, and we're just going to wait back for the results now and see. We spoke to Jake before and made sure he was all okay without us. And um, yeah, at the moment, just waiting for the results back. But hopefully, he can um, yeah get back soon and see Jake again because kind of miss him. So. Who's been in the, in the roof? <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. Mm. <gasps> oh my god. Holy shit. Oh, what? Who was that? Who was that? Another guy. Oopsie. Your new Allcastle home is where un... Hello. Another guy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oopsie. What? Beck was kissing another guy. So, Rebecca, what we're wanting some clarification on was that. Who was that? That was my brother. Wait, wait, that was her brother? I don't kiss my brother like that. It wasn't like sexual. Oh, oh, oh. Was that your brother? Yeah, I was at home. Do you kiss your brother like it's that? It's like you kiss your friends. Like you're telling me you, you kiss Booker like a friend. Can't handle this night. Wow. Can we watch it again? Because I, I know can what a brother looks like. Can we watch it again? Can we watch it again? Can we, can we see that again? Should watch it again. All right. Watch it again. Tell the truth? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Hey, baby. Hello. Hey, Definite hash on the lips. It is literally there. Oh, Beth, are you kidding me? That is not a brother. I mean, let me make it clear, we didn't think it was a family member. Clearly, but we don't know. Mm, we don't know. We're just trying to uh, put it to you to get some clarification. What's going on? Who's the guy? She has to own it. She has to own it.
OK, I'll, I'll come clean. Um, my dog needed transporting, and I reached out to an old burn um, who actually took Oscar to the clinic for me. And when I seen him, emotion kind of sparked with us. And we did. We shared a kiss. Well, 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 well. That's next level. That's naughty. Rip the bears after it. Correct, and I did. I went straight ahead into the house with you, and I should have been open and honest about it then. Yeah, you should have. It would have saved all of this. Look, it was a mistake, but I'm telling you now. I'm sorry I keep swearing. I'm just, I'm really frustrated. Yeah, I get that. Mm -hmm. I get that. I'd be frustrated too, but. It wasn't, it wasn't romantic for me at that time. And I did, I wanted to give it a go with Jake. See, the whole time, the whole experiment, there's been no affection, nothing. Even to this very moment right here, we've never had, we've never had sex. And I'm clearly, this is why, it's all adding up to me now. We just didn't connect as well as obviously I hoped. Now I know why. So, Rebecca, help us understand. Is this a relationship that has been going on for a while or just uh, an ex that rekindled when you went back to Perth? It was literally just someone that I had met previously. You've come clean with just that now. Could you possibly... Is it possible know. that you were with this guy through the whole time? Well, absolutely not. That's three whole months away from home with you and dedicated to you. So did you go home for the dog? The dog? Or you went home No, the dog... Him? OK, well, you, you know that my dog is really unwell. Yeah, but you can't tell me that you weren't messaging the guy before you went home for the dog. He, he must have known. Question? Yeah, so I asked him to, if he could take Oscar to the appointment. Well, he's doing more than that, wasn't he? Thank God you guys found that. Thank you so much. Well, we we'll make it clear, we, we didn't know what we were looking at. That's why I'm we're, being we're getting about clarification it. Why don't you who's your brother? I'm being honest and open right now okay, about good. the situation. Now that we've got you in that yes. headspace. Beck, do you have feelings for this guy? I think, I think I do. Yeah. Have you remained in contact with him since then? Yeah, I have. You oh. should have dumped me at the vows. I didn't want to dump you, Jake. I can, I'm a big boy. I can handle that. No, but you told me you were different outside the experiment. I wanted well, to so go outside so the experiment So you were just playing this guy you. as well? No, I didn't say that. I what? said I stayed in contact. There's no... Wait, we're not talking like it was a relationship contact. I'm you being honest about my pick feelings about him. You can choose who you want to be with. You let him on. It's so simple. You let him on. We're taking your word for it. That's what we're doing. Because right up until now, this moment, you and I were fine. We'll f what do you mean we'll find? What are you feeling, Jake? I'm empty, mate. I'm shattered. Well, this has been quite the revelation. Jake, you, you know, there's a lot of feelings there. Very raw right now, and we can see that. And we're very sorry that it's happened. And we hope that uh, in time you can process that and, and move forward and heal. But for now, we're going to let you go. It's all right, Jake. It's all right, mate. I'm going to go see if it's all right. That was a big twist. That was a good It's all right, dude. It's all right. Oh, I feel very sick.